Teachers carrying guns in school is a controversial topic among many Tennesseans. Good evening, I'm Casey Getz. News 5's Johnny Nordello spoke with local law enforcement to find out their reactions to this new law. Tennessee Governor Bill Lee recently signed legislation that will allow teachers to bring guns into school. And many people are left wondering, what are the reactions from local law enforcement? It's all going to come down to uh, strict scrutiny and management of the director of schools and uh, law enforcement and the principal. Frank Rogers is the chief deputy for the Unicoi County Sheriff's Office. He believes a law like this can work for them because of the open line of communication between law enforcement and school leaders. Here in Unicoi County, uh, everybody knows everybody. There's rarely a day goes by that we don't have a phone conversation at the least with the director of schools. The new law states that teachers who want to carry guns have to meet certain requirements. Rogers tells me that in Unicoi County, educators have to go through psychological evaluation and 40 hours of school resource officer training before getting a weapon. The, the law requires that whoever is going to take this responsibility on, they have to meet basically the same benchmark requirements that school resource officers have to make. However, not all counties in Tennessee are on board with arming teachers. In a statement released by the Johnson City Schools, they state, Johnson City Schools does not plan to allow staff or faculty members to carry firearms on campus. They also say that there is at least one resource officer assigned to each Johnson City school in the district. The new law also states that parents and other school employees do not have to be notified about who is carrying a gun. Rogers believes that this can add an extra layer of security. You might have one teacher, you might have two in a school. You might not have none, but nobody's going to know who they are. And it's the, deter the deterrence factor of knowing that there could be. He believes that ultimately the right decision relies on each area's circumstances. Every jurisdiction is different. Some places it may work, some places it may not work. And that's for each jurisdiction to decide, I think. In Northeast Tennessee, John Nordello, News 5, WCYB.